Am I found? 50 cents? Well, heck yeah. Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm in Indianapolis, Indiana at Audrey's Place. Now there is a furniture store over there, but this building right here is an antiques and collectibles place. So let's go in and see what we can find. And look, we got my baby girl. We came to see Emma. Look at him, Emma. There's another one up there. There's some Jim Beam. Oh yeah, he's got his buddy up there. Some Jim Beam. Things. Oh, here's the little, shirt. the blushing Willie. What behind the shirt? Was there a clown? Oh, hi, hi, sir. Oh, yeah, there's more puppets. They're everywhere. This little guy, it is California pottery. I have sold this little fellow before. He is two dollars. I'm gonna get him. I have to rescue all of the California pottery pieces. All kinds of little critters over here in buildings. Some angels. How you doing? Some Mary Gregory right there. What's and that? it's the artist. It's a Fenton to Mary Gregory. No, you don't even know Mary Gregory. Some what's another little piece of Fenton Bell there for thirty-five. Lots of fins and fifteen dollars for the cream and sugar set. That little mini jack in the pulpit is ten. Thank you. This place just keeps on going. <laughs> look at all the flats grass. But look at the little false graph turtle. He's cute. Look at this punch bowl. That's beautiful. Under okay. Wow, look at that. That's gorgeous. $69. It's got the ladle on the inside. And the birds here. That's beautiful. Got more angels and birds. This one might be. Oh, it's a bluebird by Jonathan Byron. This one's kind of cool. That's newer, made in China, I do believe. Blankets. I love these blankets with the little soft, the soft um, trim. I love those blankets. I do. Emma found a bunch of M. A. Hadley. There's little napkin rings here. Little dipper. Yeah, it's a little dipper. And it's empty when you get your Sorry, there is one your food out of it. Some of the mugs. I don't see any mugs. A little cow. Oh. They're cute. Some of the mugs, those are napkin rings. Oh. When you lift up the mugs, they'll say, all gone. All done. Cute. So here's some linen. And this, I believe, is a... Yeah, that is very 90s comforter. Tablecloth. Well, it's got some tea staining on it or coffee stains on it, but it's five dollars. It's not bad at all for a nice tablecloth. And here we got these blankets that I like. Still in the package for eight dollars. And this one, the Chatham, an outdoor umbrella canopy. Beer grill. Hey, there's lemons on that. A table runner with lemons. David and Sarah need that. But that's 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 something. Places like this are nice because like you can go and like there's all kinds of stuff to look at. And so look at the TV lamps. Oh wow. $79. Yeah, and say so I wonder if this is a cron and it is K R O N. So it's a TV lamp and then the lights, the eyes light up. But there's a lot of really cool ones here. So we've got the cats and the doves. And this horse is amazing here for $59. That's $59. 
This one's $59. She's got a booper on her hat. But an amazing array of TV lights. Awesome. Gosh, look at this Coke dispenser here. $449. My son would probably like that Lego thing. I have a trunk just like that. It's really neat to see. What is this? Jim Beam Steaks. Nice. All the little West Bend um, ice bucket. <gasps> Spuds McKenzie. These are for your eyeballs. You wash your eyeballs with those cups. Oh, it's dopey. He's $29. He's cute. Yes. I like him. Some records here, too. Oh, this bean crock that we see everywhere. Made by West Bend. That's kind of cool, though, that it has its stand. Oh, cuties, Mark. Oh, look at the puppets up there. Fifteen. The Mother Goose game. Hey, can you stir can you stir him up? Does he whine? I think his head bobbles. Oh no, he no, he does more than that. Here, let's set him down. Yeah, he doesn't work too well. We've got Elmer Fudd, we've got Mickey. Ooh, Mickey, you're like a foamy Mickey. Oh, Mark, did you see the He-Man puzzle for $5? Masters of the Universe. Skeletor. Oh, here's the skunk game. I've sold this skunk game a couple times. It's $5. The box isn't in the greatest shape. But Dragon Dominoes. Twixt. Oh, isn't this one of those? Let's see if we can look through it. Ooh, pretty. Here we've got the Bionic Crisis. Lucky shot. Scrapple. Table Croquet. That seems like it's a fun game. Huh. Cute little box. Oh unusual things you can do with cream cheese you never know you never know what are the oh these are just like little oh that is cute soup cookery pepsi stuff down there oh these are these are made by gobel i do believe um yeah western germany i've had and sold these <laughs> little little fellas before they're really cute here's his buddy Five dollars each is not a bad price for those. Gosh, look, there's Yogi Bear cookie jar. Better than your average cookie, says Yogi Bear. Oh, there's a Red Riding Hood. I'm going to be selling the one I have soon. We've got Porky Pig. It's made by Shawnee. This is Hager, I think. Yeah, Royal Hager. $29. This is different. It's kind of cute with a little. It's an ashtray. It's $10. The rooster on it. A little, I think, a peacock, a pal, and mason. We've got some ashtrays. Oh my goodness, look at how cute this is. Oh my gosh, look at the little table and chair. I need grandkids one day. They can sit at that table and eat their breakfast. Oh, he's supposed to have his little girlfriend with him, but he does not. He's three dollars. Little piece of chalkware. There's a little Florida Bell. Oh, it don't have a dinger. These little guys. You guys still having fun? Yes. Good. These are California. Oops. Uh oh. My finger took off the price. Three dollars for the pair. Now, these look a little bit like a Jane Fonts. It's Jane Fonts. They're very hard to find. These aren't. But it's mm, something Grimes, California. They are California pottery. She, They're $3 for the pair, but they have been repaired a lot. His poor head has just 
come off his body. It has been glued back on, but Lessie Grimes, California. Oh, they're pretty marvelous. Oh, this little bowl of need too. It's 19. Got some Melmac. We've got some little trophies here. Girl Scout trophies, a Boy Scout trophy. See, when you see these jadeite mixing bowls a lot, and they go with a stand like that. This is a really fun end of the day, like a end of the day blown glass. It's $49, but I think it's great. Fall staff. I've had several of those before. These are probably Bakelite for $10. They were originally $5. Um, the butterscotch color knives. Pretty cool. Mackinac Island, Michigan. Good job, Emma. I need to send a picture of this to Jeffrey because he has a display case pretty similar to this. So I'm going to send that to him. A lot of this ruby, like this is from the Indiana State Fair from 1950. And I love it because these were sold like at fairs and things. And you could get a little, little memory. This says uh, maybe Hannah, 1903. There's 1920. Mama, 1919. Merle. Pearl Lee. 1903, 1918, Martha, Sarah, 1898, so that's the earliest one. Boy, somebody didn't do a real good job at their writing. Virgil, these are beautiful too, the boxes. Don't normally see the boxes. I see the little, um, you know, the mugs and stuff a lot, but Clara, 1921, uh, Raleigh to Dorothy, 1946. That one's $29. Just fun to see. Look at all these chalkware pieces up here. Those are fun. I see Santa. I see a Santa bank for $10. He still has his lock, which a lot of times you will not see. The lock is usually missing, but it's the Christmas fun. So I am going to get him. Ready? Bunch of children's books. Emma said she's look through them. I do not need, unless it is an absolutely, unbelievably cool book, I do not need any because I have so many books that I need to sell. Novels? No, I need no Western novels. Good Lord, have mercy. That's frightening. Jack and Jill, he's wrapping his present. He doesn't look too happy about it either. Oh, that's cute. Those little kids falling down there. Key cat. I think I've tried to sell some of these Jack and Jill books before and they, people went a little crazy about them, so, story a day. Ooh, this one's cool though. That's a scary looking Santa. This is from 1956. Okay, these are $3 each, it says. Some of the ads might be cool in here though. Well, I think we're gonna get those. Like I said, I've tried selling them once before. I didn't think there was tremendous interest in them. Oh. Hi, baby. That little fella they mounted his little feeties right there. It's $399. Hi, fella. I like your little feeties. Hi, babies. Place just goes on. I think they said they had there were 15 rooms. This kind of area looks like the fanciful things, which isn't normally my thing. I like the, you know, the kitschy things. Under five dollars, but I think you're just a studio piece. Somebody's bonnet. Ooh, but those are nice. Oh, look at the baby on the flag. So I like those. I have these in the smaller set. These are the Cupids. These are antiques. Uh, Cupid at rest, and I think Cupid at play is the name of the other one. I have them in a smaller version. Oh, baby. There's lots of babies in here. Oh, my word. Oh, look at them. 
Ay, 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 baby. Oh, no. She got little friends. She got a little Bobby. Yeah, my little Bobby. Bobby. Pretty quilts. Ooh, this one, this quilt is $75. Not a bad price. This one's really fun with all the patches and stuff on it. Oh my gosh, there's a witch. Okay, that makes me want this quilt just because of that girl right there. That's fun, like a little memory quilt. I'm more looking for the kitschy things. Yeah, these things are very nice and pretty. This is neat, the little um, smoke stand. $249 for that. Slag glass lamp is beautiful. $399. Ooh, look at this Weller. <gasps> this is the Luelsa. Oh my gosh, that is not a bad price. So you've got the Jardinier with the stand. I, you just, you know, you need to go and experience. Go out and find you a piece of Weller Luelsa and touch it. Just touch it. It's so beautiful. I love that. Beauty. Here we have some things that Ariana would like. The taxidermy. Oh, oh, look. No. Mermaid. Mermaid. Next to the taxidermies and the cash registers. And lots of fun things. These scales are amazing. There's a Toledo scale there. It's pretty amazing. There's just all kinds. Oh, there's another mermaid. All kinds of things to see. It's just really fun. All kinds of different things for everybody to look at, too. That's what makes it fun. What you looking at, Emma? Uh, More cookbooks? Pretty... Yeah, it is. I don't think it's old. Uh, this is neat. Nice. This, like, bar. Aw, look at him. $329 for a little baby. You need an axe, cookie. Maybe if you were a firefighter. That's a baby bottle. Yeah. Well, maybe for a baby shower. Or maybe if you were a firefighter and you wanted a, you, you want an axe cookie. There's an angel. What's that what one? This? That is a little bonnet girl. There's a broom for a witch. Butterfly. That's Santa. Santa right there. And right here reminds me of Enamor Amy. Because when we went to Colorado, she came and her mom made a bunch of shortbread cookies and brought them in this kind of a tin. There's no cookies in this tin though, Amy. That makes me sad. They were very good cookies. Emma found 50 cents. Well, heck yeah. Because we need more. I need more of these. This will look pretty with Lucite candles in it, but I think those are a little small for that. Got longer burger and some brass. And clocks with some copper molds up there. We've got some salt and pepper shakeups. A little graduation people. This is Alaska, Arkansas. Oh, these are nice. I'm, they're still in their little package. Aloha from Hawaii, South Carolina. Those were Santa's packages. They actually should have a Santa go eat. There should be a Santa with each of those. Lots of little Hummels in here. And we've got some lady head vases. 89 lady head vases. Um, up here, this looks like it might be Royal Copenhagen. Yeah, it's 39. She's a little mermaid on the rock. It's kind of an iconic thing for them. Then also down here, I see these little, these little guys, they look like Campbell's soup kits. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at, well, can I get in here? Does this open? Do you open, sir? It's one of those cases that's like, you have to be a magician to figure out how to open it. So these are made by Goebel, but they're the Dolly Dingle series. Here we have Don Juan and Hansi. They're $10 each. You can see on the bottom here. 
They are Dolly Deagle series in association with the Margaret Woodbury Strong Museum, Dolly Deagle's friend, Hansie, 1981. But they kind of look like the Campbell suit, but Dolly Deagle, I like Dolly Deagle things as well. I don't know what I think about them. All right, I did run a, I, I ran a eBay comp on them and they sell for about $11 for the pair. So I'm not gonna get these, but there is something else in this cabinet that I wanted to look at. I'm gonna put these back in there and then I'll pull that other thing out. This just caught my eye as I was putting those in there. This is little Jack on the Pulpit carnival glass for $15. So I think I'm gonna get that. That's pretty, that's very, very pretty. But over here, I'm seeing these. These are Ted de Grazia. I didn't realize that they were, that Goebel did a Ted de Grazia piece. So I think that, I don't know if they're salt and pepper, I think they're salt and pepper shakers, but they're exactly the same. So, you can see the Ted de Grazia signature on the back there, but $10, uh, I think I'm going to leave them. Behind. All right, one thing that I did pull out is this um, little timer. I have a, a, I love these timers, and very rarely do you find them with a timer, with a sand timer intact. She's made in Japan, she's $10, but... I have a soft spot in my heart for these little girls, and she look, appears to be in great shape. So I am going to get her, as well as that Jack in the Pulpit vase down there. But then up here, I do believe, this is $21, $29. This is, I do believe this is Fenton. That beautiful, like a plum color, it's $29. So in this little jar here, there are assorted bottle stoppers. I'm gonna get a couple of them because I have lots of bottles that could use a stopper. So I'm gonna pull out a couple of these. Mm. Plus it has a sanded bottom. Mm. Let's see, oh, there was this one in here. Oh no, I do like that one. So I think I'm just gonna get this one. All right, you hear me talk about the rimple, the rimple things that I, the little planters. Well look, I found a DG, which is rimples. And this is the storybook that goes with all of the little um, planters and stuff that we find. I don't see a price in it right now. I'm gonna have to ask. I'm just trying to find a place that I can look at it. Let's see. Let's try here. <laughs> um, but yeah, here are, are, we've got Frisky the horse, Milky the cow, Fleecy the lamb. Moo Moo, Milky, Milky the Cow, so all of the little characters back here. This is done, I think, in the 1940s. Uh, Store by Ruth Rimple, illustrations by Dietrich Rimple and James Wiley. Uh, 1949, so I'm going to see how much they want for this book. Everyone's always just wondering what kind of cars Mark looks for. And these are it. Mark, you want to tell people about the cars that you look for? So most of these are from the late sixties or early seventies. Mm -hmm. um, of course, it says what they were. What yeah, they're, they're they, the, the, it's nice that they're detail, listed. But, yeah, um, they're all red lines. So you can see by the wheels that they have red line mm -hmm. around the wheels. Yeah. On, on all these. And he's saying it's a really good price on them. Now, that, is that in a transformer like yeah, Crasher? Yeah, these are transformers, but so he's. Um, but he, they've got about a half dozen in here. So he's he might get him a couple of those, but. People are always asking, what does he look like? Or what kind of cars does he look for? That's what it is. That's what he looks for. Oh my gosh, look at Donnie and Marie and the socket to me. That's from um, Laughing, I believe. The Bionic Woman. Look, Pat. Look, Pat. Look at all the, the lunch boxes here for you. I'm not going to get any of them. That one's $80. But, oh, we've got the Hulk. And the little people schoolhouse, some ninja turtles, an erector set. Who are you? 
He's an alien. They also have a lot of like architectural salvage and things here too. Oh my gosh, look at this door. Asylum for the Insane. Evaluation Center. That's fun. Hi, Mermaid. Some tobacco baskets, some architectural salvage, lots of cool things. My goodness. Door knockers and these that go on your towel bars. Doors. Ooh, these are different. These are heavy. More mermaids. Floor vents. Absolutely great. Oh, look at this beautiful fireplace. Great place to come in to get some salvage. Look at, oh my gosh, look at that sink. Look at the barber chairs. Wow. I want this one and that sink. Oh my God. I would put that sink in my bathroom. That's amazing. This whole barber set is unbelievable. Look, they've got the, the things down here where they would straighten up or they would sharpen their blades. They've even, they've even got car doors. They got lots of things. Lots of really cool. That's Errol Flynn. Look at you. Are you? Er I think you're Errol Flynn. Yeah, you are. He was a something else. That Errol Flynn. He was a party animal. Got camera equipment and photographs. Oh my gosh! See, I could sit here all day and look through these pictures. Wait, that looks like a party. These ladies here. Oh, what they got? She got her drink in her hand. Uncle Fred's getting a little frisky. I won't look at the pictures all day, but I could. Oh, look, she's got. Look at the, look at this girl. She's got a jack o' lantern cake. She got that creepy doll over there. Oh my gosh! Look at all her presents. Aww. Oh, look, Manitou Springs, Colorado. We were there. Here is a little Lefton November Angel. Oh, it's, she's got a little part right there where her flower is boobered, but her head is still on, and so are her wings. She's $5. Yeah. I'm not going to get her because of that damage. I, I Normally it doesn't bother me that bad, but I'm going to hold off on that. I am going to hold off on that. This is Italian. Made in... No, you're made in Spain. Forget what I said. Look at these. This is a family. It says family on their little... On our little tag. Family. And then that tag back there says ties. So we've got, I wonder how much these are. We're still, it's $10. So we've got the mom and her children. And then we've got another mom and her children. Family, okay, family ties. Well, that's pretty cool. I like that. Well, January girl's gonna throw all her logs on your fire. Well, thank you for going shopping with us. Emma, you wanna be in the ending with me? We are going to go to a couple other places here in town, but I'm going to go ahead and end this video. This was a great place. My gosh, just fun things to see. Wonderful prices. Kind of something for everybody to see. So if you're in the Indianapolis, Indiana area, I will put all their information down in the description. But stop into Audrey's place and um, take a look around. See what kind of treasure you can find. Uh, thank you so much for going shopping with me. Don't forget to subscribe if you are not already. Hit the thumbs up on your way out, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Red hot mama, red hot mama, but I have to turn my temper down.